Hello, this is Professor Pearsall, and I decided to start making some YouTube videos that would hopefully be helpful to students and maybe other people. This first one, I just want to show you a few simple things with Microsoft Word 2007, um, <clears throat> which um, currently, 2009, they have on the Porterville College campus computers. So. Uh, one of the things we have to do often is write formulas. For example, let's say we want to write the formula of water. So we type that H2O, right? Notice that the 2 is a normal size 2, and we would like that to be a subscript. So what? one way to do that is just to select the 2, and then go up to this font button. And then notice we have different options here, and we would like subscript. So I'm going to check that. and. There's my H2O. There's another way to do that. Uh, let's say again, we typed it out, and I select the two, and I'm going to press my right mouse button, and we're going to see options here. I'm going to select font, and now I'm going to check the subscript button, and there it is that way. Finally, a third option, <coughs> which you can't see on screen, but I'm going to describe, is to use a key command, which to me is easier because then I don't have to move my hands away from the keyboard. And I'm going to press Control, hold down Shift, and then press Equals, <coughs> which actually gave me superscript. So that's not what I want. I want Control, Equals. That will give me subscript. So, and then if I keep typing here, uh, then it's going to remain in subscript, so I'm going to press it again, Control equals. We'll go back to normal font like that. That's how we do subscript. Let's say we want superscript, which I already described. So let's say we want to do ammonium. So I'm going to do subscript there. So the key command is con Control Shift equals. The mistake I made earlier, and then I'm going to try plus the ammonium cation is plus charged. And again, I'm going to type that key combination again, control, shift, equals, to make my font normal once again. So that's how we can uh, do a, a few formulas. Now let's say sometimes we need a <coughs> the uh, degree symbol. Like let's say we want to say 25 degrees Celsius, which is standard reaction temperature. So I use a key command usually, which is... Alt 0176. Alt, I press and hold Alt, and I type 0176, and there's the degree symbol. Another way to do that is, it, is to go to Symbols. So I am going to go to Insert. Now the symbols are to the right here, so let me see if I can fit this on here. There's the symbol. I'm going to go to Symbol and look for degree, which I don't see on this list, so I'm going to click more symbols. This is on the symbol font. I don't see what I'm finding here, but I'm going to go to the font I was using. See, this is a more complicated way, which is why I don't do it. I do the key command. But I'm going to go to... I was working in this Calibri font. So if I scan through this, I'm going to look for the degree symbol, and here it is right here. I'm going to select it and click Insert. Now I can close this, and my degree symbol is inserted. Okay. So that's it for now. So we'll do more of these later. Hopefully they'll help people. Bye-bye.